What's going on guys? So my shipment finally arrived from St. Sivion. I'm pretty sure that's how it's pronounced. Um, here it is. So it, it was quite a bit of time for it to ship and arrive. But the one thing I will give them credit for, each bar is like handcrafted and handmade and everything. And these are supposed to be like high super high quality luxury bars um these go for around 12 dollars each on the website and they're not huge bars they're about four ounces so they're supposed to be really high quality we'll see um but the other thing i wanted to actually give them kind of a shout out because i thought i accidentally ordered too much stuff when it arrived they ended up sending me an extra bar and they sent me a, a soap saver dish too. So that was pretty cool. I've never actually had a company send me extra bar, full bars of soap before and extra stuff like that. I've had like samples given, but they just gave me a whole nother bar. So that was pretty cool. That was my first order ever with them. They are handmade in Missouri and the one that I originally bought was the one I'll be doing the first review on. That is this one right here. This is the Fresh Cactus and Avocado Bar. The other bar they gave me is the Damascus Steel Bar. And this one was actually the other one I was looking at. And I almost got this one as well. But I was like, well, if I'm going to buy a $12 bar of soap, which is probably the most I've ever spent on one bar. I figured I would start with one and see if I liked it and then kind of go from there before ordering <laughs> more bars from them. But that was pretty cool. And it'll be nice to have another one of these. I do have one from Dr. Squatch. Um, that was a cedar, a cedar soap saver. And then I also have a bamboo one. This one is pine. Yeah, I can tell this one's pine. So you can never have enough of these. So let's get into the review. As you can see, um, it's a nice little package. It's nothing too crazy. It's pretty simple looking. Um, you can kind of see the bar right there, but let's pop it open. I can tell you already though, this, this smells pretty high quality. Um, the ingredients in this bar, we have avocado, of course, cactus, and then sea moss, which I really like. I really like soap that has sea moss in it. And then we also have aloe vera, mica, and I don't know how it's pronounced exactly, but it's either Tusa silk or Tusa silk. I think most of their bars have that silk in them. So really high quality ingredients, nothing unnatural in here. Um, besides that, it's just water, olive oil, coconut oil, grapeseed oil, shea butter, yeah, they don't even add any kind of... Well, and then they add um, a couple essential oils of like lime and eucalyptus in there. But that's it. So no no artificial stuff. It's a very small... I actually didn't realize how small these were until they came in. I expected them to be bigger. But here it is. It's a really nice looking bar. And here's the other side. It's really cool. It's a really cool looking bar of soap. Handmade, handcrafted. And yeah, wow. It's pretty good. Uh, I can tell by feeling it that the bar just, just feels super high quality. The scent for this thing is really good too. Wow. So I'm getting a combination of lime and eucalyptus. It's a really good combo. But in the background, I'm definitely getting that cactus. I'm getting a little bit of the aloe in there. Now there's no mint in this bar and it doesn't, it doesn't really smell like mint at all, but for some reason, Maybe it's the color, but the feel of this bar feels very similar to the Crypto Cleanse bar from Dr. Squatch. 
I'm talking about like the physical bar itself feels very similar to that but you can tell this is like very very high very high quality very good, good quality soap and the scent is very good it's not really woodsy scent but um I do like this a lot and I'm excited to check out the Damascus Steel bar but this one is very good it's a very this is just a very nice refreshing scent very relaxing this is like you're on vacation at a luxury hotel and whip this out in the shower, the steam's going. You're feeling like a million bucks after using this. So here it is, St. Sivion. And yeah, I have to say this definitely gets my stamp of approval. I've done a lot of reviews for bars of soap that are from smaller companies. And some of them weren't great, like, well, like we know, Outlaw Soap, and some of the soap from Dapper Yankee was good, some of it I didn't love. Um, there were a few other brands we tried, Urban Eden was a good good quality brand, but the scents weren't really for me. But this is a good bar, I think this is a company that anybody can use really, because the scents, there's a scent for everybody out there. Uh, it's very broad. So that's my review. And I'm excited for the next one, so we will see you next time.